Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with Doug. こんにちは。今日は美味しいコーヒーを入れて、冷たくて喉越しのいいデザート、コーヒーゼリーを作ります。コーヒーは約90度のお湯で入れます。First, let's grind the coffee beans to make fresh coffee.Using a hand cranked coffee grinder is fun and gives you a special hands-on feel. Next, place the coffee into the filter in the dripper. Even out the grounds, making a flat surface. Slowly pour just enough water in the dripper to moisten the grounds. Let it sit for 30 seconds. Then, very slowly drip the hot water over the grounds. Continue to slowly drip the water over the grounds until you have about 250 ml or one cup of coffee. Remove the dripper to avoid the last few drops as they can add a bitter astringent taste to the coffee. Next, add the sugar to a bowl and pour the coffee over it to dissolve it thoroughly. Then, add the gelatin powder. And stir it into the coffee. Pour the mixture into a chilled square mold. Make sure to remove any surface foam or bubbles. Aranets got to let her days of Kodesh, carry cut a m e t a c r a s i このようにしっかり固まりますこのようにコーヒーゼリーを入れるとコーヒーゼリーを入れるとコーヒーゼリーを入れるとコーヒーゼリーを Sprinkle a little cocoa powder on top, and it's ready to serve. This is a great recipe for staying cool in summer. Regular milk, evaporated milk, or sweetened condensed milk can be used instead of the whipping cream. Hikitate no mame de tsukuru kohi zeri wa kakubez des. Zei tsukutte kudasai ne. Make sure it is well chilled. The jelly will begin to melt if it gets too hot. Good luck in the kitchen!